Bill C-21. It's Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's strategy to address gun violence and strengthen gun laws in Canada. I think we're all here, regardless of which political party we belong to, uh, to do what we think is best to keep Canadians safe. But what began as a national freeze on handguns has evolved. Opposition MPs, including Conservatives and NDP, have voiced concern after proposed changes were put in place by the Liberals to expand the scope. Trying to vilify hunters is not what anybody is trying to do. What we are trying to do is to make sure that there is a comprehensive list of weapons that should be taken off our streets. The amendment now adds some long guns to the list. Part of the criteria proposed by the Liberals would ban any rifle or shotgun that could potentially accept a magazine with more than five rounds. Critics say that includes many rifles designed for hunters. Measures in, in the amendment in particular that has been table dropped uh, at the last moment on this Bill C-21 that was focused on a handgun freeze that has now turned into an amendment that is focused on arguably the, the most law-abiding demographic in Canada. Conservative MP Alex Ruff arguing that over 2,000 types of guns have been added to the list. We could have firearms Z. There's only 10 of them in Canada. All 10 of them have been used in gun crimes in Canada, but they don't necessarily, they, there's no guarantee they're going to be on the list, even though they might have been responsible for killing lots of people. Correct? Whether or not a firearm is used, a specific firearm is used to commit offenses was not a criteria criterion for establishing the list.